Hello and welcome everyone. Harbor City has been released the other week and today we have gotten our first bigger content patch, the Knights and Squires update. And for that I'm going to... oh, nice shot. I'm going to test out what they can do. Well, somebody asked me to play... oh, that was a close one. Somebody asked me to play Musketeer full strength on the attacking side. So I'm trying to combine that. I'll play Musketeer full strength on the attacking side with the new units that I was able to recruit. First Siege Tower is already on the wall. Ah, let's give this guy some greetings. Alright, and boom. There you go. Lovely. <clears throat> now we're shooting down. Can we? Can we? Oh. Oh. Holy hell, that damage. That was quite some damage here. Um, let's take our woodcutters back for now. New horse. And, yeah. Let's start with the Domestic Spearmen. Oh, yeah. I also got the Spear Sergeants, I'm going to play them later on. I feel like you have to risk your units, usually when you try to push up the Siege Towers. Well, let's see. Uh, oh, there's quite a few of our allies pushing through that gate. I think we can help them and join the action. Okay, great. Uh, oh, okay. Now, because we're still playing full strength musket, we can, at, at least, you, you see the bomb interrupts those units, so, especially for Arkabuzias and all those ranged units, that will just interrupt them from dealing damage to your troops for a moment. Okay, if we can now, well, I don't know, well, damn it, we're not going to take their base A too soon, but, um... If we can already just keep them from defending A. The Damascus Spearmen, they're a great combination of shield wall and a bit of damage. But we did manage to keep them away for a moment. And I don't know why this guy just didn't push in. Maybe he saw the Prefecture Pikemen. And there goes the bomb. Lovely. Yeah. Well, the Damascus Spearmen are not that amazing. But after all, they're just a tier 2 unit. And in the siege battle, they have to, yeah, they just have to deal with uh, strong enemy heroes and tier three and tier four units. I think I've already seen some tier four units. And you know what? If I hit this guy once more, then we'll go on our horse. Yeah, nice. Get on the horse and hunt him down. There you go. One more shot. No, didn't help. Lovely. Okay. Okay, now it's time to get out of here. We are taking A. I think, even though we didn't really conquer anything with our troops there, we did not take control over any specific part of the map, we did hold them back from coming back to defend A. So now we have A. That is already quite nice. Um, I think those Domestic Spearmen, probably rather the, the Spear Sergeants, are a really great unit to stop the enemy from pushing to a position where you don't want them to come. Okay, I don't know, are they trying to hold us here? No, they're already retreating. Except for this Nodachi guy. Okay, let's bait him in. Yeah. Nope. What did you think, man? What did you think? Of course I got that leap. And yeah, I think now he's he's going to go out of here. And he lost his troops there. Maybe we can hunt this one out as well. Oh my god, the zigzag is real, huh? Yeah, no. No way I can hit this guy. Alright. Spear sergeant. I was thinking maybe we can take the squires to uh, to capture the supply point. And then take out the Spear Sergeants. But I really like those Spear Sergeants. I think I want to go with them first. 
Okay. They do not defend it at all, it seems. And here comes another beautiful fact about the sergeants. They come with the shield transformation. You don't even have to unlock them. And now we built that wall here. They are never going to capture back this supply point. I think we're in full control over them right now. Let's see. Oh, nice. We also got some support. Slow him down. Take him out. Deal some damage. And it is so important to take control of this point. That's something I see people do not understand. If you have control over the supply point, not only can the heroes, the enemy heroes that are alive, uh, restock on units, they cannot get reinforcements, uh, but also, you cut, as you can see right now, you cut off their dead heroes, the dead enemies that come back to life with a new unit, from defending the, their base. And bait, and there we go. Leap away. And I don't know what they're doing right now. I hope somebody's going to help me because if they do the same mistake right now, if they do not defend the supply point with me, then I don't think I can hold this. I have three enemy heroes with troops and everything. And wow, I think, yeah, first one's going down. Oh my god, if you look at the HP bar, they've barely killed a few of my men. And, oh god, okay, that was four enemy heroes right now and the wall is still standing that is amazing of course i got support by those uh, arquebusiers here and there and some some allied troops but they there were four heroes and i didn't manage to break up the wall i think what we're doing is pretty pretty helpful for our team we're doing god's work ladies and gentlemen they cannot send in reinforcements to defend their base. We got the supply point. Their heroes have to think, well, do I want to be useless or do I want to die and not participate in the game for maybe a minute or so? Depending on how many times they died. And if you look at their base, there's only a few of them still there. Uh, maybe we can send in our, our trebuchet strike right now. Let's see. Okay, yeah, there's some enemies. Perfect timing. And le yeah, let's go. Let's go. Oh, God. One moment we left the supply point and we're alone. And they're trying to kill us. And Oh. Oh, okay. So I got one kill with the trebuchet and then one kill with my spear sergeants just now. Wonderful. And if you look at that, they are barely taking damage. They survive so very long. It's really, really amazing. And... Thankles. <laughs> oh my god, lucky seven. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Well, I have to give up the supply point. I will go and get my squires and try to take it back or... Well, do I even have to? If we look at their base, they're... They're not even bothering taking the supply point, are they? Okay, yeah, now. Now they are. But now they have to push through all of our defenses. I don't even make it to the supply point. We won the game. Amazing. I think this is a great combination. These spear sergeants, they hold... They can take a beating. They hold the enemy back. They can deal some damage. And with the musketeer we can make it much easier for our spear sergeants to to take control over the battle. And we killed exactly seven heroes. Nice. And a beautiful drop. Oh my god. I love it. I really love it. But I couldn't really make any use of the squires this time. Let's try to go for another game. Alright, another game. And we are on the same map in almost the same position again. Well, at least this time I should have a bit of training to handle these cannons and take out their cannons. Let's see, can we get a first shot on that thing? Nope, close enough. Uh, well, let's go for this one first. Let's see. A bit... Oh, well, we dealt some damage, but a bit too low. Okay, he didn't kill it. 
Nice. Just on point. Perfect. And there was another cannon there. I think it already got destroyed. Alright, let's focus at their other cannon over here. Okay, I didn't really mean to kill the, the Facha, but that's even better. Uh, I meant this cannon. Okay, the cannon's already gone. Let's see how many shots we will need to destroy the ballista that they have there. And that's not going to what again okay that felt weird again just through the passive exploding damage yeah let's build our shield wall up here and have a look although looking at the map doesn't seem like a really amazing opportunity okay yeah let's yeah, let's use this uh, turtle formation okay another defending unit that is going to suffer a lot from my AOE okay oh god this guy just called in a Trebuchet strike on them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, we gotta heal again because we're not full HP and I don't want to rush in their half life. Alright, let's shut. Oh god. Okay. They have a lot of archers here. And I think I just missed my. My liquid fire or my Keltrops. Oh, hey, look at this guy. Yeah, you better run, my friend. God damn it, I'm bad. Okay, let's give him the bomb. That helped. And apparently they're not focusing me yet. That's great. Uh, Caltrop's just in the middle. Now we build up our shield wall. And... He really wants to feel it, huh? Why are... Come on, guys, help me. Why are they walking so slowly? Okay, he's getting on his horse, trying to kill a few of my men. And there you got your Caltrops and more Caltrops. And I missed a shot, damn it. Oh god, oh god. Okay, let's give him the bomb, liquid fire, burn him down. And why the hell are my Damascus Spearmen not attacking him properly? Are you serious? Why? Oh my god, they didn't have... Alright guys, finally we get to try out our squires. Mm -hmm -hmm. Hey. The Mesnus Spearman. Alright. I don't want my my squires to attack them. To engage them. Ah, come on. They're automatically pushing forward. I really hate that. If they could just turn that off. If I want them to go into position, I want them to go into position. If, they, if I want to, them to attack, then I press the attack button. But why the hell do I put the go into position button and then they attack? Alright, I think we can pull off our shield charge here in a bit. Add their... Okay. What the hell? Nobody's defending the supply point again. Well... I want to make use of the squires before uh, before we win the game and before I pull out the spear sergeants from the supply master. Okay, so they have some some troops here. Nobody coming from their spawn. All right, let's go. Ah, perfect. I think that's something where these squires will be pretty useful. Oh God, I just wanted. Okay, they've they've just retreated here. Let's give them a little bit. There's some enemy guy. Alright. Uh, come on, shield rush. And... My god. Okay, I think... Well, first of all, I did something wrong there, clearly. Alright, now we pull out the spear sergeants and reform this wall over here. Let's see, maybe we can hold them back and win the game for our team. Uh, well, I don't think it will be quite necessary. We're pushing their spawn right now. Alright then. 
Count me in. I'm gonna join that party. Nice. Okay, I think I told. Yeah, I totally missed my bomb there. Unlucky. Um, but anyway. So apparently now we're building up uh, a defense in front of their base. That's actually one of the smartest things you can do. And since we already have these iron cap spear guards, I might as well just put my my spear sergeants in there with the same block formation. Yeah. All right, this guy is pretty risking. Uh, is risking it pretty much there. That's not going to cut it, my friend. Yeah, he could, he could have just suicided here. That's pretty much as useful. Nice. And a bomb. They're, they're giving their dandest. They're trying their hardest to push through here. I don't know what happened to the Iron Cap Spear Guards. I'm pretty sure they did not all just die. Um, yeah, I think he's, he's taking them to push towards their base. Let's set... Let's set them into into a oh god okay. Well now they finally managed to to take out all my spear guards, uh, all my spear uh, sergeants. And holy hell, we're at the brink of death. Let's just run from this guy for now. Oh god, that was close. <laughs> was the sh uh, throw shield a bit? Oh god, jump away and there you go. And I think I want to make it on the horse. No, he's making it on the horse. I think I'm going down here. Oh. Okay. Well, I th did I not throw my bomb? Yeah, but as you can see again, just keeping them from sending reinforcements to their base for a minute or two pretty much wins this map for the attackers. And I feel like many people do not understand that yet. Alright, summarized you can say the spear sergeants. Let's not talk about the Messner spearmen. They're okay at what they're doing, but they're just a tier 2 unit. They're not going to make a difference later on. The spear sergeants, however, you can take them, put them on a spot. They will defend it well while dealing damage. And that is why I'm going to skill them on the lower line which will increase their damage output and slightly decrease their defenses and later on uh, put a little bit of honor into their defense because uh, then you have a pretty strong unit that you can defend any point with. You can build a shield wall, you can go into the shield run formation, you can just have them uh, in this block formation. It just goes so well with so many good combinations there. There you go. Bottom line, they're level 4 now. And yeah. What can I say? The Spear Sergeants are amazing. The Squires, I don't know. I've never really played with the Swordsmen so far. I haven't even unlocked the Iron Cap Guards. And I'm not planning to. I don't really like that kind of unit. Well, if you want to learn anything about the Squires, learn it from someone else than me. But um, I'm going to keep grinding some honor so I can level up and improve all the units. If you want to go for the Spear Sergeants, definitely go for them. They are really amazing. I'm really impressed by them. Um, yeah, that's about it. There are some other big changes. Something they didn't deliver while they promised it as uh, more skill pages from the weekly rewards in the, in the reward pool. Um, that's kind of sad. But um, yeah, the new unit line, you've seen it. Pretty, pretty damn good. That's it for today. Thank you very much for watching and see you in the next one.